The Oregon State Marine Board is reminding boaters to be respectful on the water. Really think of others when you're out there because they say lately there have been issues with motorized boats capsizing or even swamping smaller boats, which is not only dangerous, but can also be a criminal offense. And Fox 12's Audrey Wheel introduces us to a group of paddlers who have experienced this firsthand. As they embark on their Monday evening practice, these dragon boaters say lately their sport has come with an added challenge. It's a, something that we're constantly aware of. It was just two weekends ago when Lori Charlin and others remember a scary moment in the Holgate Channel of the Willamette River near Ross Island. It happened just so suddenly. You just have absolutely no time to anticipate or brace or prepare. They say a speed boater came through so fast and so close in a no wake zone that their dragon boat capsized. I watched as the hull, the bottom of the boat, flipped over and threw all the paddlers out into the water. We ended up mostly under the boat. That to me is just reckless, dangerous behavior. The state boating safety manager says it's a terrifying trend lately with instances like that one, where not only did the speed boater cause the accident, he then took off. It was shocking. Goodness, if you cause someone to capsize, please stop and assist and make sure that everybody is all right. That's not only the right thing to do, but the legal thing to do. Not stopping is a misdemeanor, and luckily in this case, no one was injured. But if they had been, that could be a felony. Now the Dragon Boaters and the board say all they want is a good experience for everyone. It would be great if we could find a way to all respectfully share the river. So that they can all stay afloat and stay safe. On the Portland waterfront, Audrey Wheel, Fox 12 Oregon.